Hi everybody and welcome to the Bad Badcast. Oh my gosh. Is that what we are? Yeah, we are the Badcast. I uh, I am your host Will and with me as most of the time is Shane. Hello, ladies. <laughs> And this week we are playing Gears of War 3 um, in Horde Mode. Uh, I have spent quite a bit of time on the game, though this will be my second Horde Mode, and Shane's new to the title. And uh, yeah, I've spent none of the time with the game, or or the series at all, actually. I, watched, <laughs> I was at a party like five years ago and saw somebody play a match once. Nice. So that means I'm a pro, right? Yeah, I think I, so. I'm an expert. I, got, I know all I need yeah, to know. Yeah, you, you've got everything on lockdown okay. now. What could, so. what could possibly go wrong? No, exactly. So, uh, let's go ahead and uh, talk a little bit about the news. Uh, start off with movies. The guy who created the Mortal Kombat Legacy short films that I found boring... <laughs> And so unexciting has decided to make a Mortal Kombat movie. So, way to tarnish the only semi-decent video game movie. Um, well, now did um, is is did he just express an interest, or is the studio greenlighting? Oh, he's greenlighting. Okay, he's, he's going. He's got it. money for it then. Well, yeah. okay, I'll I'll say this. Um, I think the movie has a potential to be better than the series because he's gonna have to conform to like established movie principles and like screenwriting principles. So he's mm -hmm. not gonna just be able to like meander through pointless storylines like he got to with the series. So I think I, the the restrictions that are gonna come from that may actually benefit the movie in a way. Okay. Um, All right. That's just that. That's my guess. Yeah. Um, because like there's potential there. Like you know when we all saw that original trailer that he put up, uh, you know wanting to do a series, everyone was like, hell yeah, this yeah. is gonna be awesome. Um, but it was because once once he was given kind of free reign, he was a lot less. You know I, I don't think he knew quite what to do yeah. with what he had. So when he's got to write a simple basic three act movie. You know, and and do everything the, the the established Hollywood way. I think there's a chance it could be good. Yeah. Uh, at at the very least, it's going to be better than Mortal Kombat Annihilation. So that's you know, true. He's going to have at least the second best Mortal Kombat movie. That's which, true. You know, hey, that's you know, that's not nothing. Yeah, yeah, definitely not. Um. Oh well, see your your things carry over, so now you're still level two. Oh, nice. Angle. Okay, yeah, because I, I did get in the one practice match, so yeah. now I don't feel oh, that, totally pathetic. That's pretty cool. Kind of yeah. gives me a you know. At first, I was trying to hold on to my money, and but now uh, yeah, spend, spend, spend. Yeah. All right, so I got a ticker, couple of tickers that's coming. <laughs> tickers that we can't hear. Yeah. Uh, thanks to the the awesome blue mic, which is just <laughs> it's too good, so it'll yeah. pick up the game and us. Yeah. Oh. There we go. Take right. it, take it. We're getting, oh, there's another one. Yeah, we're getting tagged. I'm gonna die. Oh god. Oh god. Get away. Get away. Get away. <laughs> and there's another one. Oh god. 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 Da. God. Get God. Oh. Okay. At least they got a. So beer. let me show why this is a family game. All right. Yes. Uh, you can chase oh. all the enemies. Um. Thankfully, they the uh the tickers have a very small blast radius. It seems. Yeah. Well, but if they do tag you, man, you you're feeling it. So. Uh, so second movie news, um, Dead Island is has already been greenlighted. No. As a movie. Yes. No. Yes. Oh God. Yeah. No. Uh, that you know what happened there, right? Some studio exec saw the trailer and was exactly. like, "This will be a fantastic movie." And, and then there he's gonna have no idea that the game actually is nothing to do with that. And that is it exactly what it is. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I did read a report that it is just about that Ready family that. Okay. Well, you know what? Actually, that might be okay then. Yeah. If if he wasn't bait and switched into thinking, you know, like, oh no, no I've got to do the movie stuff or yeah. do what was in the game. Like, if they do the story of the family and do some like fun time, like Memento Inception style, you mm -hmm. know, storytelling, then maybe it'll be good. You know, maybe it'll be what we thought yeah. the game was gonna be. That's true. That is true. Some of them. He's running. Oh, here we go. Everybody is so brain injury, it's hard to tell who you and who's the bad guys. Like, now, for anybody who is confused what's going on right now, I am using a bad guy as a meat shield. It's pretty awesome. 
And uh, if I ever get tired, oh, well, he eventually does die. But if I ever get tired of him, I can always just uh, melee and oh, geez. he's getting a little ambitious there, apparently. Um, and snap his neck and, and run on my merry way. <laughs> so shots are coming from somewhere, but I can't figure it out. Yeah, I, I am. I'm noticing a distinct lack of radar in this game. Yes. Yes, very much so. All right, got another meat shield. Let's see. Is it? Let me go ahead and highlight. There we go. No, that's how you do it. <laughs> um. Somebody is shooting me from some. Ah! Oh, gotcha, you son of a bitch. I am using my pistol. I don't know why. Because you're just hardcore like that. Yeah, apparently. Uh, to to our left. Good call. Last one. All right, wave two completed. Uh, let's see what else. The creator David Cage of uh, Heavy Rain has announced that there will not be a heavy, heavy rain two. Oh yeah. Well, okay, that's good. No, that's mm -hmm. good. Cause what do you do? You know. Uh, the only thing that I could possibly see is it is it ending up like a um, saw, it, but for video games, like there's a different <laughs> decoy. Yeah. Oh, you got a decoy? Yeah. Oh, nice. And it's, it's a cardboard cutout. Oh, out. yeah, yeah. Give him a thumbs up. <laughs> that is Cole from the game series. He used to be the uh, thrash ball, like, you know, the Michael Jordan of, of, of thrash ball. Um, and so he is called the Cole Train. Going or what? <laughs> yes. That's a good one. All right, let's see. There are These guys remind me of Captain Kirk in the way they, they lunge around. Mm -hmm. uh, Rolling from place to place, or a little bit like Tim Allen in uh, in Galaxy Quest. <laughs> you got a couple guys around here, I can see. Yeah. There we go. Um. Somebody, oh, there. That's my problem. Get off of me. Uh oh, uh oh, no, 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 no. Uh, it looks like you took a blast at the face yeah, there. Yeah, I, I most certainly did. I was trying to, well, I should say I did, um, executed somebody while they're on the ground. But then oh, the ticker said hello. And so, there we go. I will see the, say the A button can get you into trouble as much as it saves you. Because you can go hiding, but then also it's the long, you know jump button. So um, at the same time, you can... Easily jump into some of these yeah. fire. Oh, oh, there's somebody. I'm definitely getting shot. Yeah, I, I see who's shooting me right here. Oh, I see. And I shot him in the face. Whoa, flamethrower. That's not good. Uh huh. Down. Go down. Oh, oh, now I'm getting flamed from the right. Um, I just shot your dude. <laughs> oh. There we go. Oh, you were the most cash this way. Congratulations. Uh, most cash, still on the most kills though. Mm. I wonder if you if you get cash if people walk over your. Uh, uh, I think you spine. do. I think you do. Oh, it literally is a decoy. Yeah. You can, and you can repair it. That's crazy. I thought you were just making a joke. No, no, it's oh, literally wow. a decoy. Like, that is good. It it's a decoy. It's totally awesome. Oh, wow. That is totally awesome. Oh, I wonder if these command posts create guns that you can buy. Good to go. Huh. Alright, bonus wave. I don't know what we're supposed to do in the bonus wave, but bonus no. wave. But I got all kinds of stuff, uh oh, careful wave. Here we go again. I think I'm pretty well defended over here this yeah. time. We'll see how it goes. Uh so in a bit of sad news, the uh homeland security this week took Video equipment from a famous uh, fighting game reporter, uh, Team Spooky. Really? Uh, it, he was coming through the airport, and they confiscated a, whole, a lot of his equipment, and um, said that it was for Homeland Security. So, so in addition to all the other things you're not supposed to bring, now don't bother bringing any like film equipment. Uh, exactly. With you. Uh, you know, pretty soon they're gonna just say, "All right, naked." Why yeah. naked? Exactly. Can't bring anything with you. 
And it, I'm down, by the way. Oh, are you? Yeah. Oh. And I got a flamer on me. Oh, gosh. Oh, thank you. Okay. Alright. Time to roll out of there. Yeah. Yeah, roll nothing. There we go. <laughs> oh, God, it was. Alright, I'm there's, there's a boom guy back in the distance here. Yeah. Do any additional? It does. Okay, it good. does. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm quite good at that. Yeah. Nice uh, quasi destructible frame here. Oh, definitely. He's hiding under that. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ooh, I am down. Uh oh. Uh oh, bonus objective failed. Ooh, and I am dead. Oh, and there's four more for me to kill? I'm yeah. so toast. This is not gonna end well. Oh god! Oh, oh god! Get oh away, get away, get away, get away! I'm back. Apparently, you can buy your way back in. Uh, oh, good. Thank you. I did not know that. For that I mean, it took all of my money, but. You know what, though? You're here. Yeah. That makes me happy. Oh, there we go. Woo! Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta give it up to you that one. I, I, I uh, was a little ambitious for my own taste. Yeah, bit off a little more than you could chew. So, um, I will say one really sad note about the Team Spooky thing is um, he has not set up a uh, donation box or anything along those lines because he said that the, what's the point, you know, if they just come and take it and things along those lines. So it's almost as if he has given up a little it's bit. Feeling a little defeated. Yeah. yeah, it's well, it's tough. It's like, what do you, you know? Yeah. What's to stop him from doing it every single time you exactly. fly at this point? Exactly. Um, yeah, I, I'm more and more, because this week there was also another story about a, uh, a breast cancer uh, survivor who has a medical device. Mm -hmm. um, they forced her, like, uh, they, they forced a, after she went through the back scatter, they forced her to do a pat down. Um, even though she was explaining to them that she had a, a card that would explain exactly what the device was, you know, the, the registration number, the doctor who pl implanted it and everything, and they refused to let her get the card to prove the situation. Really? Yeah, and they basically just loudly said, if you don't do this, you don't fly, so that all the uh, all the other passengers could hear it. Basically just an intimidation factor. Wow. Um, so, you know, for, for months now, ever since the, um, the backscatter stuff, I just shoved the deep button. Um, yeah. Ever since the backscatter uh, stuff started coming out and the pat down began, public opinion has been pretty wildly gone against the TSA, and I think um, you might start to see some like substantial protests. Yeah. I think people have pretty much reached the breaking point. You know, some of Bin Laden's dead. Uh, the the number two guy was killed last week in a drone strike. Yeah. Um, and and quite frankly, Al Qaeda hasn't done anything to us in a decade. Yeah. You know, the, the person who's done the, what's done the, I'm down, I'm like, yeah. uh, what's done the most damage to, uh, to uh, Americans' perception of safety in the last year has been the TSA. Yeah. You know, they've been the one disrupting our flights more than anybody else. You know, and the idea is noble, I, I grant. I'm coming know. to help, yeah. Thank you. Uh, when, you know, when the TSA came into being, the idea of having a little extra safety and, you know, actual human beings to check and make sure, you know, we're safe, I... The idea is, not, but it's just been executed for. Speaking of executed, I'm down. Oh, are you? Okay. So, but uh, uh, so you know, politics on the bad cast. But uh, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, oh, you got a, a boomer on. Oh, I can why. buy back. Uh, how do I buy back? Why? I don't have. Enough. <laughs> They're just taunting me. Buy back for fifteen hundred dollars, Mister Thirteen Fifty Five. I wonder if I could give you. Money. Oh, jeez. Worry about surviving for now. <laughs> oh, time to run! Time to run! Yeah, yeah, ammo. Yeah, yeah, ammo. Oh. Oh. oh! That that did us in. Well, we can continue from the way that we were on, luckily. So yeah, I'll give that wave one more shot. Yeah, let's see what let's see what happens. Um, let's see what else. Oh, um. A grown man attacked... This happened in England. Um, he, <laughs> this is a good one. He 
was playing Black Ops, and the kid was taunting him because he was beating him so much that he went over to the kid's house and beat him up. <laughs> <laughs> what on? I mean, how, oh, just I mean, come on, you know, <laughs> quite ridiculous. Um, that he he knew the kid, so he knew where to go to to beat him up, and he did. He went over there and started beating him up. And uh, luckily, the kid's mom was there, and he has thus, you know, apologized and things along those lines. But really, it's now. Um, this, what, what, where was this again? It was in Europe somewhere. I think it was in England. In England. I'm not so now, was the guy arrested? Is he is is he facing charges, or I, was it just one of these like crazy things? It was just one of those crazy things. I don't think he's been charged with anything yet, but uh, unless it's changed within the past few hours. But right. um, now. Uh, in completely unrelated news, and I only know about this because I know a person who, oh geez, plays Eve heavily online. Apparently, <laughs> the Russians, the goons from Something Awful, and another one of the large alliances have all come together and now control 60 or 70 percent of the space of, all, of of everything oh wow yes and now that's amazing because uh i, I you know i've i've played eve for a while and i i, I haven't for the last month or so mm -hmm. uh, so i haven't i'm not up to date on what's going on in, in zero zero space but um the russians the red alliance um have been pretty for a long time I'm down. I'm right okay i'm coming uh have been pretty just why what do i press for x oh, there we go um have always been pretty bitter enemies of uh, the Goon, the Goon mm -hmm. Squad Federation and uh, the Northern Coalition, uh, which is probably the, the third party that they were talking about. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm surprised to hear that they've that they're have declared some sort of treaty or something. That's, that's yeah, very surprising. One of the guys who, uh, the, one of the guys that I was talking to about it said they have decided, and and this is the only thing that they were able to come to an agreement. They want to know if they can break the game. Right. They because they they're working on um, I, I forget there there's two important items that you need to get tier two items. Um, I forget what they're called. There's some kind of specific gas and things along those lines, and they've m cornered the market wow. to the point where in ten hours they had s gone up nine hundred percent in cost. Wow. Um, and so they're trying to make it so the company has to reboot the game because they said that they wouldn't what would it take for them to you know right so um i'm interested to see how it goes i i uh yeah oh now i have decoy unlocked nice i wonder if i can i can repair it yes yeah they can be repaired yeah um yeah that's interesting uh mm -hmm. i would like to see what ccp ends up doing uh the developers in response to this because uh this will be one of the first times that a large group has actually tried to actively attempt to to break the game. Like they've always been very in favor of the free market, letting kind of people do the crazy things they want to do. Yeah. But that's that's taking it to like we deliberately want to you know destroy Only the game's game. economy. Exactly. Yeah. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how they react to that. Yeah. Um, but what what saddens me more though is I'm I'm I enjoy so much watching the. Uh, the massive influence and serenity changes in the uh, influence map. Basically, every day they post a map showing the updates of uh, system control changes, and it's kind of fun to watch. You know, this swath of red take over a, a sector that was dominated by blue in the span of three or four days. So if they if they're if they're um, you know if they've got peace across the galaxy, there I'm I'm kind of saddened by that actually. Mm -hmm. um, well, apparently they're focusing on all the smaller areas that they. That combined, they did not control. Jesus, I'm right in front of a boomer. Just give me a second. Right. Yeah. There, there's a bit of a there's a bit of territory in southern security space that was kind of uh, not lawless, but there's a variety of smaller alliances that, that had control there. So if they've maybe tried to clean house there, because they they basically they've always existed simply because in that region simply because the big alliances and coalitions never really cared enough about that space to take it. I am down, but I apparently am close to you. Yeah, you are. There you go. So, oh, are you down? No, I'm, I'm not about to be. There we go. Urgh, now he's down. Alright, let's see if I can. 
Give me some cover. Oh, a little speaker. There you cover. go. You may want to run back and get some ammo. Yeah. Oh, shoot. I, I got that guy that was shooting at you. Thank you. Where's the ammo? <laughs> uh, oh, right where this bad guy is. Phenomenal. There we go. Boomer's down. Nice. All right. I see you, buddy. I see you. How many times do I have to melee this guy? Oh no! Ticker. Ticker. There we go. Okay. Melee down. Uh. All right. Take a hit from something. Oh. All right. Take a guy away from the bit. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, you got, got him. him. Yeah. Um. How many are left? Uh. Looks like one. one? And I think he's over here. He is. Oh no, there is many more than one. I oh, okay. apologize. Yeah, because before they had numbers, but now there's just like a bar. No. Ticker. There we go. Got him. I might be going back for uh, ammo. Ammo here in uh, I, where I'm at, uh, which is to your back and to your right, uh -huh. uh, I've got an ammo crate under con in my control here. Alright. My side looks a little bit clear. Oh, there we go. Woo! All right, so the achievement even continues, e you know, continues even if you've lost. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I well, like that. it's, a, it's a progress bar, so yeah. that's kind of cool. All right. Oh, we got some money now. Yeah, we do. All right, here, that barrier. Um, oh, here we go. Okay. Put up a, put up a decoy. Get some level on that. Get some ammo. Oh, trade off my sod off the. Should have waited on getting ammo, but yeah. <laughs> it's all right. Oh shoot, I spent my money. Oh. No, you've got like two thousand left. I know. I was gonna get that other command place, but I think it cost four grand. Yeah. Well, oh, there we go. <laughs> and we got these guys in the way. Yeah. So should be good. Probably from behind you. Yep, you're right. I thought the decoy there would save me. There we go. One word to people that play online. Teamwork. <laughs> Indeed. You need to stick together. If, if I ever lose a game, like it is always because the other team is working in conjunction with each other. A little, bit of th little thing called communication it goes a long way. A little, little bit of strategy, <laughs> guys. That I say as I run away from you. I will say though that I I am constantly the person running behind flanking, so right you now. Oh, I may not be the best. Do do as I say, not as I. Do. <laughs> so and yeah, I no, I feel it. That's right. I'm uh, that's right. I'm working uh, teammate teammating up with my decoy over here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> there we go. Come on, come on. This guy's running away. That guy is smart. I have to give props to that AI. <laughs> he saw me pull out the chainsaw and, chain saw and run away. Right, I'm pinned down back here. Are you? All right. Let me see right here. And surrounded. Oh, shh. Die, 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 die. Okay. All right. Let's see. I'm picking up people on my way back to you. Nice. Uh, all right. Yeah, the problem is they broke through our defenses over here. So yeah, got I, I had, had a few you know, spikes drift. Ooh, ooh, this guy's got. Oh, well. Uh oh. I think I might be in there. Well, I, I think oh, I, nope, I got him. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, I think we both just fought off our uh, respective yeah. trouble. Oh, hello. Oh, here we go. Hello. Have you my meat shield? Thank you. How does not? How come shooting that tank does not? Oh, it does! <laughs> I was wondering about that. Shooting the uh, the flamethrower guy's tank. Oh. Well, um, you, apparently yeah, you hit the. Uh, yeah, I guess you, maybe it was a yeah. bonus objective or something. But. Yeah, apparently. There, there's also dollar signs. Yeah, I just noticed that. I'm like, yeah. money. I'll take money. Yeah, go check that out. Money. I'll hold them off. I'll hold them off for you. So, oh, okay. Oh god, that guy 
okay is fine, right? Um, I mean, he'll do a little bit of damage to you, but... Oh, I see. Is this like a ammo box or something? Yeah. Oh, I am down. Um, let me see what I can do to help get it through. That's right. I'm right near you. I just need to kill the guy that's right in front of us. Wow. Oh, now I'm done. Help me. Help me. <laughs> now, I Thank saw you. I saw your your health bar hurting. Oh shoot! There's a guy behind us with a shotgun. Yeah, they're, they're right I'm there. down. Oh, oh no! It was right there. I was hitting X. <laughs> oh come on! All right. Well, I think that's a good spot to finish it off for right now. Yeah, so. I think so. That was that was an epic yeah. victory slash loss. I don't know what to say. But so, yeah. we'll probably continue from the current way, but. Uh, you guys go ahead and have a good week and um, continue having a good week. <laughs> Bye. See ya.